The British Indian Ocean Territory contains one of the world's largest marine protected areas and allows scientists to study an almost pristine marine environment. We have arrived at Biot and we are anchored in the Laguna Egmont. We are busily setting up equipment, ready to deploy. Scientists from Plymouth University are using the latest technologies to investigate different ecosystems in the ocean and to understand how they can be protected. During their six-week expedition, they live and work from a ship, which contains over 10 tonnes of scientific instrumentation. Behind me is the container, which is our laboratory and our ROV shack. Over here we have lots of equipment stored for transit. This equipment includes moorings, which will record oceanographic data for several months, multi-beam sensors, which use sound to create detailed maps of the seabed, and a remotely operated vehicle, to explore deeper parts of the ocean that divers are unable to visit. The ROV has a manipulator arm attached and we can use this to attach onto a coral colony and break a small fragment from the colony. We can deposit each sample into an individual tube which is numbered. Once we've finished collecting all of the samples, both the ROV and the platform are recovered to the ship and the samples can be removed, catalogued and preserved and ready for transport back to the UK where they will undergo molecular analysis. This state-of-the-art equipment is helping scientists to conduct experiments, collect data and survey unexplored parts of the ocean which would otherwise remain hidden from view, all of which is helping to conserve these important ecosystems for future generations. Yeah.